What's up guys, welcome back to Pew Pew Brothers. Uh, today I'm talking about everyday carry stuff. Um, kind of with the craziness going on, I'm gonna talk a little bit about, um, with it being kind of getting to be summer, nice out, spring I guess. Uh, shorts, what you carry with shorts and you know how to be prepared that way. Uh, so I don't wear shorts very often. I'm going up to the lake today, so I am wearing shorts. Um, and I'll go ahead and show you. This is what I carry in my pocket. It's a Uncle Mike's size three pocket holster. And then a Ruger LCP with the little extended magazine. Gets me a halfway decent grip. Um, obviously this is a pea shooter 300 or a 380, 380. Uh, it's rocking some Hornaday hollow points, just like all my carry guns. And I carry um, the this one magazine. And then I carry this another one, same style. Um, just carry it in my pocket. Pretty much just right next to my wallet. Um, also, I'm carry... Today, because I'm going fishing, I'm carrying a little cleaver style knife, a cricket. This is the Pilar with a little extra grippage, helps give me a full grip on it. Um, I've sharpened this with my um, my work sharp, so it is stupid sharp. And then, because I feel undergunned, and because at this point I'm pretty much bringing this thing everywhere with me. Um, I got my little AR pistol, clearly the pistol grip. And then for storage, stowage, storage, I wrap my strap around the arm brace here on the back. So I just take it and wrap it around. And then I hook it around my pistol grip. That allows me to still use the firearm i can still shoot it and then i can strip this thing down and sling it when i need um obviously you guys was, if you haven't seen the video on this gun check it out um that was actually a really good video um i have it unloaded for the video but i always carry it loaded with this is a pmag uh gen 3 gen 2 pmag 30 rounder usually loaded um, and then I've got a couple spare mags in the truck, a couple, three or four, kind of stashed within there. Um, I picked that up from Todd, who told me that I need to stash more ammo, so that's what I've done. They're in spots where they stay now, and that way I know where they are. I can easily tell somebody where they are, because Todd and I were talking about that in a situation where you'll meet them, you're not going to be thinking logically, you're going to be using your monkey brain. So you want to be able to tell them, you know, passenger seat underneath or, you know, glove box. There's one in there all the time, you know, constant type of deal. Not like, well, it should be here because you're not going to remember that stuff. So, as well as all this, you're going to remember your vehicle. You've got your vehicle, you got your, you know, egress, your way to get away. Um, but, uh, as far as usually when you're in shorts, you're going to do something, you know, activity wise, obviously I wouldn't be swimming with my pistol in my pocket. So you gotta, you know, you gotta think about that type of stuff. You go on vacations, chances are you're not going to have a pistol. You definitely ain't going to have this with you. So there's always those situations in which case when you go on those vacations where you can't bring your firearm or. You even have a knife, you're pretty helpless. So you gotta think about that stuff, but we all do it. So it is what it is. You can't stop living life because of, you know, fears and that's not what the American life is about. So anyway, hopefully this video is kinda helpful. Also, as far as the pistol goes, you can carry a lot of different styles of pistols in your pocket. Um, this one's really comfortable. It's easy to draw from. Um, I do carry it in my left pocket, 
most of the time because I have my pocket knives and other stuff in my right pocket. But, you know, is what it is. So, this will be a quick one. Thanks for watching. Again, if you haven't seen this video, go check it out. Um, maybe I'll do a re review on this uh, Ruger pistol that I've got. Maybe not. I don't know. Depends on if you guys like it. So, all right. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Comments are awesome. I'm always in, I'm always replying to comments. Um, it's kind of fun for me. So, keep keep it up. All right. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you later. Peace, brothers. I'm out.